What's up everybody? You got Lucas Holt here and Addy Net back at it again. Today what we're gonna answer for you, why the hell is everybody moving to Ridgefield, Washington? Stay with us, hit that like button, hit subscribe, hit that little bell button for us. Do not hesitate to reach out, give us a call, give us a text, give us an email anytime, 24 seven, put us to work for you. So now let's get into Ridgefield, Washington. here in Ridgefield. Tall man Lucas, why are people moving to this area of Ridgefield? No one even heard of this this place, what? I'm trying to think, back in the day, I think 10 years ago there was yeah, nada. I mean, even nada a few nothing. years ago, people weren't really talking about Ridgefield, but now, so Ridgefield as a city, they did a great job city planning for the long term. This area being on the northern end of our greater Portland area was always kind of targeted to kind of be an expansion area for greater Portland going forward in the future. So with that being said, the city of Ridgefield knew that and they kept on saying no to all these big box stores, all these builders and everything to develop their land up here. Now fast forward a few years and that need for additional housing has really exploded here in Portland. So now Ridgefield has came in and started releasing some of that land to actually be developed, to actually have builders come in and give you the most modern homes, give you the most modern stores, all that kind of stuff. And so what you'll see today is some land that's put aside for development. You'll see their old historic downtown, which is going to be completely revamped. You'll see a bunch of new construction homes and the school district is just absolutely phenomenal here. So it's the second rated school district on the uh, Washington side of the Columbia River for us right now. So Greater Portland Market, highly influenced by your school districts. So obviously Ridgefield is going to be up there in demand for us. Love what you're saying there, Lucas. It's totally new builds everywhere. Everywhere, it's all new builds, 90 something percent new builds. So you're getting all these like little tiny neighborhoods that are pocketed and named and you have your little communities. But this area that Lucas has taken us down to is near the water. So this is gonna be primo waterfront, trail walking, river views. Um, it feels a lot more spacious out here. It used to be Camus was your main option. Kids for school on the Washington side was Camus, and this is definitely a boil over. Exactly. And what would you say the affordability rate is? Oh, it's we amazing. Know it's better, it's but. amazing. So, I mean, up here right now, kind of depending on the area that you're in within Ridgefield, old historic Ridgefield, kind of this downtown area, entry point, you're going to be, you know, 500K at most. And that's what kind of the typical is for Ridgefield, though. Even all these new constructions there's great new construction opportunities for around 500k we're actually closing on one in one week here Addie and I that is just about at 500k single family home for us so if you're looking for kind of an affordable route to go with a great school district Ridgefield's a great option you're gonna sacrifice the, the distance to the city for you but it's still within driving distance to Portland for you with that great school district. So that big grassy area that you're looking at right now, that's actually going to be the new uh, Ridgefield downtown kind of waterfront for you. So they have planned in here, they're gonna put a 
bunch of different commercial stuff. So whether it be shops, restaurants, bars, all that kind of stuff is just going to pack this area right along their side of the river here. So this is gonna look totally different in just a few years here. It's gonna kind of take over as the new downtown Ridgefield. And that's just part of the reason why people are moving here is the city plan itself. So what you're looking at now is going to be one perfect example of what the new construction communities are here in Ridgefield right now. You have a variety of builders coming from Lennar, DR Horton, you're going to have Pacific Lifestyle. You have just a bunch of different people in this area. So you can really pick and choose whether you want a single family. Do you want a town home? What do you want and in what area? And I love that they're all in the hills. There's a really easy opportunities to be able to get somewhat of a view and everything. So just kind of another idea of why so many people are moving here. You can get really affordable new construction at a great price. So here's another great example for you guys of what the new construction is like. So right now you're looking at Gavin Homes. It's a custom home builder for you. These ones are gonna be around, I mean, above your one millions for you. It's actually one of these are listed right now at 1.3. So it kind of gives you a different idea between what we were just at, the entry level new construction into some custom homes that are going on in this area too. So as we fly around the drone here too, you'll actually see all of this new construction going on is still surrounded by the original OG farmhouses, all of that kind of stuff as well. So even though you have all this new construction, there still is an opportunity for those older farmhouse style homes with a little bit of land as well. So two different styles of houses there for you. So in Ridgefield here, it is a mixed bag. There's mostly new construction, but there is that opportunity for older existing homes as well. So now you're looking at another reason why everybody is moving to Ridgefield. It's their high school for us is absolutely phenomenal. Out of the greater Portland area, I would probably put it at, you know, in the top five school districts of the area. I would put it at the number two school district on the Washington side of the Columbia for us, right behind Camas. So this is an actually great school district for you guys. And Again, Portland Market, so influenced by how good the schools are, and this is just one more example of it. All right, so we're sitting here now at Discovery Ridge. So again, brand new commercial area for Ridgefield for us. Another reason why this place is booming so much. So as I said before, how Ridgefield pushed off all of these different companies from coming in and building up their infrastructure. They're now coming in and you're seeing phase right now. I think they're in phase two or phase three of this construction plan for us. So as time goes on, you'll see more and more commercial start coming into here. All right, everybody, so that was Ridgefield, Washington for you and why everybody is moving to that area. So again, if you haven't done so, hit that like button, hit subscribe, and hit that bell button to be notified every time we put out a new video. And again, don't hesitate to call us, give us a text, or give us an email anytime, 24-7. Thank you all, and have a great one.